Hello everybody and welcome back. Well, here it is. <laughs> Finally. I fixed everything. Uh, something went wrong. I couldn't see my screen. I, I could only see the screen on OBS instead of my monitor. So I fixed the issue. It was a frame uh, refresh rate. It was way too low. So here I am, finally. Alright, so this is my first time ever importing a save from CK2 at all. This should be fun because we still have our Mongols going on. Uh, kinda upsetting to be honest because I don't know how it will turn out. Probably we will last for one episode only. <laughs> I don't know. Well, at least, uh, as far as I know, you can't really be that aggressive like in CK2. Otherwise, there will be many, 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 many defensive packs, right? I believe. Maybe even right from the start. We will see. So we will still will play as a Frisian. Unfortunately, we can uh, control our genius, handsome guy that we had in CK2. Instead, we are controlling entire country. Oh yeah, there's even the name King Guy the Second Rotting. Hey, oh shit, and we have some kind of. Um, I don't remember the numbers. I think this is meant to be a decent ruler. 536. The 3 is being what? What is the th Diplomatic skill, I thought so. And this is administrative skill. Uh, diplomative. Diplomatic, not diplomative. Uh, should be better, actually. Alright. Country size. Development. Fourth level. We, we really don't care about fort levels though. So what else is new? I I'm not really fan of U4, but it's okay from time to time. I prefer CK2 because there are plenty of characters. Alright, so let's jump in I suppose. Hey Wait! Ah, this is trash. Why it's trash? Because we were playing Iron Man mode. And we never used any mods. Because I was going for achievements, of course. Ah. Well, shit. What the hell? Oh, Scotland is yellow. I thought it's a Castile. <laughs> I thought, what a Castile is doing in Norway? Oh, that sucks. Okay, so we go for normal mode. I think Delver should implement that you can also continue achievement runs. I, th I think so. Well... Ah. First try. So, <laughs> we'll see how it will turn out. For how many episodes, that is. There are some features that I like in U4 rather than in CK2. Mm, I clearly forgot. No! We only get 5,000 gold? Out of our 46,000? That's a ripoff in my book. Damn! Okay, so what the hell is this? The Roddings of Frisia. Europe is in 1444, is on verge of the Age of Discovery. Yet it is reeling from the shock of the failed crusade of... Excuse me? What, what crusade? We didn't have any crusades, aside from the crusade for Italy. As well as the threat of Ottoman... Excuse me, there is no Ottoman Empire. Please, game. <laughs> the Treaty of Tours has left Western Europe in an uneasy truce. One that looks like it would break any time due to 
ambition of the kings of France, England, or the Duke of Burgundy. I don't think the game is um, adopted to our uh, import. There's nothing that they claim there is. Uh, for example, Francism is on the <clears throat> very thin ice. They will soon stop to exist. England is, uh, well, um, there is no Burgundy as far as I know. Uh, sorry, you can't check right now. Oh, you can also see the DLCs I have. Okay, so I don't have a Cossacks. I wanted to purchase, but then I changed my mind. Mare Nostrum, Rights of Man. So many DLCs, third row? What? This is the newest one, uh, as far as I know. I only have a couple picks. Okay, interesting. Uh, so... There is no Golden Horde, as far as I know. Unless... No, this is Mongol. There is no Golden Horde. Okay. Hmm. Religion. We are monarchs. Environment. If I still remember. Okay, interesting start, to be honest. Ah, uh, we, we will not start yet. The one thing that I like here, a little bit, is that you don't have to really uh, go to war. You can try to get vas um, vassals as a... what was the name? I will take a look. <laughs> uh, yeah, offer vassalization. So they will not like really join into our our color, but they will be as a uh, as their own country, but they will be under us. A little bit better than CK2, I would say, but... Well, CK2 is different age, uh, of course. This is what I like, actually. So, they have... Oh my gosh! All retinue are gone! Ah, shit! I thought about this retinue stuff. Huh. And I thought maybe they could also convert the retinues like gold or something. But no, you get entire army count from uh, times you upgraded your holdings in CK2. Also, I think you also get a little bit from CK2 vassals. That's the correct one. But no, we could turn off the fort, really. Uh, by turn off... Wait. That's uh that is a destroy. I forgot how to turn off. <laughs> oh, return province. Holy no. Um Okay, this will be a little bit harder than I thought. I practically don't remember anything how to play this. Well, we have a little bit of army. I think we could try to merge a couple of them. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about the written news. And this. Oh. So we can. Yeah, why not? These are what? Oh my god, this is like uh, I'm playing a completely new game right now. <laughs> Shit, little bit too hard for me right now. Mm. How come France has been divided? I mean... 
This was part of Volois. Or maybe... Back in a CK2, what happened was... The Duke of Volois had um, conquered a lot, a lot of land around the France from their own neighbors. And what happened is now the Volois is now independent in U4. As this one. As that. So the land that belonged to the king, I suppose, is over here. Around. Yeah, this was his capital. I remember that much. And Poland. <laughs> Interesting how everybody likes us. <laughs> everybody likes us. Poland. Austrasia. Damn. Oh no, France hates us. Even better, so I can uh, start a war with friends. And they rivaled us. Let's do that. Mm, we can only choose two rivals, huh? Enemies. Castile is enemy? Holy crap. Alright. Rivals. Friends, I suppose. Sure, let's go with Castile then. No other options, as far as I see. Mongols... Uh, they have no idea what we are. <laughs> oh, Pope is independent, yeah. Hmm, this will be interesting. I wonder if we can uh, form something like in CK2. I don't remember, I barely remember any anything I like about Vassals, I remember that much. So we need... Do we need advisors? I don't think we need... Maybe for... Diplomacy? I will have to check this because of the... There's one thing that's fulfilled. Holy crap! The hell is this? It's something new. Uh, it's been a little bit more than two years since last time I launched the game, so I have no idea what's going on in this current patch. That makes sense. Age of Discovery. You, you cannot complete this mission. Income. Oh, so we lack 20 gold per month. Extra 10. Interesting. Click to complete this mission. Holy shit, what the hell? Uh, global dominance. Oh yes, please. Trade efficiency plus 15%. I'll take it because Trade is really good in this game. I prefer this trade over CK2 trade. Sometimes the CK2 trades uh, do not make any sense for me. To me. For me? For me as well. <laughs> uh, we can't. At least two countries. Oh, so we need allies. We don't have allies. Hmm. Oh yeah, army size. Uh, where can I check army size? This is global manpower. No, this is for sailors. This is the whole oh, maximum is fifty six. So we will we can hire more troops apparently. Um, I wonder if there is our capital somewhere you can design because I don't want to lose this capital, honestly. We can build something, I think. No, we can't. We need diplomatic technology plus four. Build something. We will get there soon enough. Decisions. Um, adopt oligarchic administration. Uh, I don't remember what is oligarchy, uh, so I should rather avoid that at the moment. 
We can purchase stability. I remember that much as well. It's basically our, our administrative points. I don't want to do that yet. We are Catholic still. Hmm. There's our military. We can build boats. Uh, which one was... Was the barks that uh, were trading around the... Around the countries? I don't remember that. Okay, we don't have subjects yet. Port is empty. Government... No idea yet. Oh. We have something. We have something valuable in our country. That is a glass. Mm hmm. Alright. And the world renewed. And that, that we obtained recently. We, oh. I don't want to. Nah. Actually, I'll avoid England. What I should... Maybe... I will try to... Ally with Austrasia? And they will accept, of course. But they will not offer vassalization. I, I mean, they will not accept vassalization. <laughs> because I think... They have a little bit... Uh, too big. They are way too big that one yeah they will uh, fudge a fudge oh in that case I should actually okay I just unpaused game <laughs> I should ally England in that case uh, are they wait no. They almost didn't want to uh, honestly be allies anymore. Sweet. Okay, so we can see what's going on in their northern sea. Bear with me, please. Feels like I'm a little bit too new to this game. <laughs> what is this? Get out of here. Not build. I'm not going to build anything. We have Joff. Oh, oh! I remember our son. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't remember. Is the ships we have? Oh, those are heavy ships. Oh, unlike oh shit. Oh wait, so select ship. Interesting, we can select missions right now. Hunt pirates. Oh yes, please. Uh, oh yeah, I almost forgot. I have to. S Set uh, trading zones around. Usually, a game sets in the wrong directions and you get less money from trades. I guess this is the English Channel then. We collect 13. Yes, sure. Okay, you go and do your stuff. The trade, though. We are trading in... Ray? No, Champagne. Okay. Which button was there? C... E. E. Okay. Huh. What if we collect nuts? Yeah, instead of transferring, let's collect maybe? 
Maybe this will give us more. Collect them. No? We collect nothing. <laughs> okay. And... Lubeck. So we get nothing. Yeah, so. Right value in the node is 2.6. 7. Point four seventeen. So we need to build ships that can uh, trade five. Hmm, that's odd. Okay, we we will then transfer trade power, I suppose. Hmm. In a We transfer three point. I'm testing this out. <laughs> so it's three point, and here it's. Oh! Wait. So it's 3.2. What about this then? Uh oh, I didn't <laughs> I didn't click on it. Uh yeah. 3.2 Ah, so there's more actually. What if we collect from there? Oh, we gain Casas Belli. Uh oh. Okay. So, we gain trade dispute Casas Belli against France. <laughs> okay. Okay. Have embraced feudalism. Speeding up their technology development and giving them the following. Okay. Alright. Yeah, so collecting is less. Okay. We will then uh, transfer power. Wait, no. Something is, isn't right. What? Transfer. Uh-oh. <laughs> Shit. My gosh, it doesn't register. Okay, I have to check this out. The Lord of Austrasia wishes. Oh, I I remember this one. Okay, so you are my biggest ally yet. I will accept your offer. Huh? What the hell? Oh, it's... Oh, man. It's less now. I remember something. So, where's the friends? Wait! Oh. <laughs> I'm too stupid. <laughs> yep. Wrong, wrong, uh, overlay. 
overall. I remember what to, what can we do? Uh, set gold. There was um. Economy actions. Issue embargo. This is the one. Yes. Combine our forces. So we have a little. <laughs> Alright, so that will be for this episode. If you enjoyed, let me know. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!